What's up everyone, this is Free Summon G. So for today's video today, I know I'm a little bit behind regarding the balance patches. So I heard you guys saying that KOG already did immediate fix on the, the damage for all the characters regarding some damage nerfs that was happening in the first patch. And a lot of the community were actually mad about this and then expressing their anger over this problem because most of the characters cannot actually do damage. This doesn't only affect those people who actually have the better enhancement and can actually afford such money to make their gear a little better, but it actually affects those players who actually doesn't have the opportunity to make their gear a lot more better and you can see those players sitting around either a plus 6 or a plus 7 even and they're not doing as much damage as they should as a class. Hopefully this patch from KOG will actually address some of those issues that they have and at the same time as we see in the patch notes kind of translated by Tuna Fish, you can actually see the damage in PvP actually decrease just to compensate the increase of damage in PvE. So what do you think about this patch that's been released by KOG just as a response from the community itself? Is it the right step direction that we actually expect from a gaming company like them? Or do we actually ex expect them to do more for us as a, of a player base versus the game developers themselves? There's always this controversy of us players actually having more experience and actually play the game a lot more and we actually have the experience and then some suggestions or some important implementations that can make the character more super better for all of us versus the developers on the other hand they actually have a limited sources and then they actually have the same experience as we do as a player so there's always this problem between us as the players versus the game developers themselves and then it turns out with our opinions saying which one's better and which one's not so there's always this ongoing battle between us as a player versus the game developers themselves so it's going to be not only going to apply to Elsor themselves, but there's going to be other games too, just like Overwatch that actually has some battles over Mercy nerfs. And you actually see veteran players actually dropping her in favor of other heroes that actually have similar playstyles as Mercy themselves think she's almost unplayable. So what do you think about this relationship between the players versus the developers? Should there be something to do about this relationship or we actually should not actually do anything about it and just keep this going on? Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of bringing this discussion regarding the second line of patches to actually fix some of the PvE damage fixes and at the same time bring about this relationship between us players versus the game developers. So if you actually like this video just drop down a comment down below and actually give it a thumbs up and if you want to get the latest notifications much more faster you can actually go back to my homepage and click that bell button next to your subscription button and you can actually get all the updates regarding any discussions topic with Elsword or any other games out there and I guess I'll see you guys in the next video.